Let's look at a molarity problem. 6.20 grams of sodium sulfide. That should probably be, say, R dissolved. In enough, let's make it R, since there's more than one gram. R dissolved in enough water to prepare 325 milliliters of solution. What is the molarity of this solution? Well, we're trying to figure out the molarity. So what are the two things that we need to know? Well, molarity is moles of solute. Well, in this case, the solute, remember, there's two parts to every solution. There's the solute and the solvent. And together, they make the solution. Well, the sodium sulfide, in this case, is the solute in water is the solvent together is the solution. So we need to know the number of moles of sodium sulfide in the volume of the solution expressed SOL apostrophe N is an abbreviation for solution, volume of solution in liters. So which of these two things do we already know? Well, we know the volume of the solution. It says to prepare 325 milliliters of solution. Well, remember 325 milliliters. Well, to get, we're going to divide that because remember that 1,000 milliliters is one liter. So we're going to divide that by three. It means we're going to move the decimal place three places to the left. So we have 0.325 liters. So we know the denominator. So right now. We know that the denominator is 0.325 liters. So now we have to figure out how many moles of sodium sulfide do we have? Well, how are we going to figure out how many moles of sodium sulfide? What do we know about it? Well, we know that we have 6.20 grams of sodium sulfide. Oh, well, we can go from grams of sodium sulfide to moles. We just need the molar mass. So I'm going to go ahead and look up the molar masses of sodium and sulfide, sulfur, well here we are on our handy dandy periodic table with sodium 22.99 so I'm going to do call that 23.0 grams per mole for sodium and sulfide ion is 32.066 so I'm going to go ahead and call that 32.1 grams per mole for sulfide ion. Well, let's figure out the molar mass of Na2S. There's two sodium, so 23 times 2, plus the sulfide, which is 32.1, equals 78.1 grams per mole for sodium sulfide. So how we figured out? Well we take 6.20 grams of sodium sulfide and we know that 78.1 grams of sodium sulfide is one mole of sodium sulfide. So that's equal to, let's go ahead and calculate it, 6.20 divided by, not going to worry about multiplying by 1, 78.1 equals 0 0.0793 moles of sodium sulfide. All right, now you need to put it all together. Because what is that? Oh, that's the missing piece that we need right there. 0 0.0793. So now to figure out the molarity of this solution, 0 0.0793 moles of sodium sulfide in how many liters? 0.325 liters. So let's go ahead and calculate that. 0 0.0793 divided by 0.325 equals 0.244, we're good to three, three sig figs, molar. Remember, 
this M is moles per liter.